morning everyone. A very warm welcome to you all this morning. I wanted to have a forum whereby our managers can share their ideas with you and talk you through some of the themes and stocks that excite them, which in turn will hopefully help you. I thought it was a really worthwhile occasion. Um, in three hours we, we, we went around the world, we considered a number of uh, different issues facing investors at the moment and highlighted some uh, interesting opportunities uh, on the equity investment front. Um, I think the highlight for me uh, was the fact that the argument was well made that active uh, fund managers, active fund management can really um, address some of the, the issues facing investors at the moment. Uh, in, in particular looking at some of the specialist investment areas such as technology, I thought it was very interesting, very thought provoking. I, I thought it was a really good, well balanced conference, I think set up well, organised extremely well. It's all provoking, the speakers were all very good in their own areas. It's just vital to listen to other fund managers and economists and just find their take uh, of the situation, which I'm rather pleased to find out is very similar to mine. My name is Neil Duane and I am the European CIO for Equities Alliance Global Investors and I'm very much looking forward today to welcoming all our clients to our first Investment Trust Seminar Day. I will be talking about Alliance Global Investors' view of the world and the environment we see, the challenging environment we see for clients today. So we're now in a period where arguably the greatest growth engine of the last 25 years, China, is now remodelling uh, for a new period of growth. It is no longer going to be resource and infrastructure heavy, it's going to be consumption and services orientated, which is going to change the growth dynamics of Asia and all the countries, uh, including Germany, that have supplied into the boom of the last 25 years. Within that environment, we strongly believe that equities offers a solution both for a return in terms of structural growth opportunities from technology companies in particular, but also from high income uh, opportunities in the equity market where we believe clients who need an income from their investments uh, can look at attractive dividend yields inside UK and European equities. My name is Walt Price. I'm the uh, manager of the Allianz Technology Trust. And I'm in London today to talk about my enthusiasm for technology. I think this is a great time to be an investor in a technology trust. But I think it's a, a transformational uh, opportunity for enterprise computing. Um, what I mean by that is about every 20 years you have a major shift in uh, enterprise computing infrastructure. The last one was in the early 90s when you had this movement to PC and client server computing and that resulted in a trillion dollars worth of wealth being created for investors and in companies like Microsoft. And the advantage of cloud computing is that rather than the Lego block approach where you're taking software and hardware and consulting and trying to craft a solution that works for your company, uh, vendors are taking responsibility for solutions. And I think that's going to lead to uh, not only lower costs for companies, but much higher productivity for those that adopt cloud computing. And so I think we're on the cusp of a major adoption cycle of a new way of doing enterprise computing. I'm Lucy MacDonald, the CIO of Global Equities for Allianz Global Investors. And I'm Jeremy Thomas, a portfolio manager in the Global Equity team at Allianz Global Investors and a co-manager of the Brunner Investment Trust with Lucy. We're very pleased to be here today at the Investment Trust Forum to talk about some of the opportunities in global equities for capturing growth and income. Meanwhile, you're sitting with a, with a stock which has got a 3% yield, which is on a 19 times um, PE, which is not particularly expensive. Uh, and you have an existing strong business, both in oncology, but also in ophthalmology as well. So it, to, to us, it looks like you're being paid to sit there while these exciting things are, are happening. And within that, we'll be particularly focusing on three sectors, healthcare, technology, and industrials. And we look forward to highlighting some of the more interesting companies we have in the Brunner Investment Trust. So the third area that Lucy mentioned was industrials. And it's quite tempting to think of industrials as old fashioned, smelly, oily, noisy factory type businesses. And why would an active manager in the modern world want to invest there? My view is in reality, good industrial companies are actually long life technology companies companies that have innovation, that have a deep moat, that last a long time, often have aftermarket revenues, and particularly companies listed in, in the Western world where we've been disrupted by the East already, that have lasted through that, tend to have something special. Hi, I'm Simon Gurgle. I'm the manager of the Merchants Trust and I'm the Chief Investment Officer for UK Equities at Allianz Global Investors. 
I'm talking today about where we find value in the UK equity market. And it's an interesting time to talk about that because there's been quite a divergence between the defensive type companies, which have performed really well and become quite highly rated, and some of the more cyclical or financial companies in areas like oil, uh, mining, banks, which are quite depressed and on relatively cheap valuations, but have obvious issues associated with them. Now, low valuations doesn't necessarily mean they're cheap, uh, and that is the challenge as an investor. Where do you find value? If you, if you want a good quality stock, you may have to pay a high price. If you want a, a, a cheap stock, you may be buying something with big risks. So where do we find value? I'm talking particularly about three stocks today. One is an industrial property company called Hansting. One is a large oil company, Royal Dutch Shell, and one is a small recruitment company called S3. Um, after that, I'm talking about the Merchants Trust, uh, which is a high income trust with an objective of delivering high and rising yield, as well as capital growth over the long term. I have really enjoyed today's event. It's been a very interesting mix of managers and presenters today. Very short, punchy, interesting presentations from the managers, just looking at the three key sectors and the three key stocks that they're looking at at the moment. And also very much enjoyed a very charismatic presentation from Robert Peston. His knowledge was clear in that presentation, but also his just energy, he really exuded it from the stage. It has been great to see so many people and have such a stimulating session. Thank you.